Hey guys, what's up? This is Cory, and welcome back to Pokemon Emerald. So, I just off-screen really quickly healed up my Pokemon. I did use uh, Revival Herb on Thorn because he fainted, and now we are continuing on with Victory Road. So, I don't want to go down there. Um, it looks like I can pass this guy. I don't really feel like battling him. Um, as long as he doesn't, like, see me all the way from down there. Let's see, is there anything else useful over here? Um, what's down these stairs? Wait, haven't I already been... Yeah, okay, this is just that same surfing area, so... Okay, good. I was able to pass him, so I'll go up this way. And there's just an item here. Psychic! Nice! I don't think any of my Pokémon can learn that, but that's pretty cool. Let me just check that, because if I if they could, that would be really sweet, but... Again, I'm not very confident that any of them could. Um, where is it? There we go. And, yeah, none of them are able to. That kind of sucks. I just want to double-check Shadow Ball, too. I don't think that Thorn would be able to, yeah. Kind of sucks that I can't use any of those different types of moves, but I'm pretty happy with my team, and I'm not going to change it, so... Uh, deal with it, I guess. <laughs> uh, let's see. I still think it's weird that I can't teach Iron Tail to Bird Bro. I can't. Yeah, that's really stupid. Um, or Thorn, for that matter. I just don't know what I could teach Bird Bro to get rid of one of those flying moves. Uh, probably Air Cutter is what I'd get rid of. I guess I could try Toxic. I don't know. I'm, I might teach it spikes when it learns it, but I doubt I would really be using that much, so... I don't know. I guess I'll just keep it for now and hopefully come up with something. Um, maybe there's a hidden item in one of these rocks? Nope. Okay, so now I don't really know where to go next. Um, I'm sure there's other places that I missed, like where the path split that I haven't been to yet, but let's see here. I'm gonna go over here so I don't have to fight this guy. And... I guess I'll have to hop back down here, and I already fought her, let's see, I already did everything up that way, I guess I have to go back up here, and do do do, have I fought him yet? No, okay, so this is new, <laughs> the thought that I'm getting closer to the Pokemon League, I'm getting stage fright, so frightened that you're just standing around in Victory Road doing nothing, waiting for trainers to battle, <laughs> I'm the only one that's actually moving around in this place and making progress, go Thorn! Okay, not too worried about a Swellow, I'll just... Oh, I thought that when you used a Revive, it actually restored PP. That would be kind of cool, but no such luck, so I'll just go for Dragon Claw. And I really hope this thing doesn't keep using Double Team all the time, because it's going to be very annoying if I can never hit it with anything. And... Okay, maybe a Crunch will be able to kill it now after that. And it goes for Endeavor. I think that does more damage the less HP it has, so that was very not good. Jeez, that did a lot. And, okay, Crunch killed it. Thank goodness. Thorns are gaining some HP from that shell bell. Only four, really? <laughs> and a Mawile. I don't know what type that thing is. I don't want to have to use another revive, so I'm going to switch out. Um, oh, everyone's up to 45 now. I didn't realize that. That's pretty sweet. Uh, I guess I'll bring Sushi out there, see what he can do. I think this thing might be, like, part rock or ground type, so... Such a weird-looking Pokemon, like, honestly. <laughs> like, its mouth is literally bigger than any other part of it, like, the rest of its body combined. So I'll just go for a Surf. And it's not super effective. Okay. Did not know that. It's for Iron Defense. I'll just Waterfall it after this. Hope he doesn't heal. It's only in the yellow, but... And he does. Okay, what a jerk. Cool trainer Samuel. You're not cool at all. <laughs> you shouldn't even be a trainer. No. And hopefully two of these will kill it. Yeah, easily. Um, I haven't used Dive yet, but it only has 10 PP, which is kind of odd, but... I mean, I have three water moves. I'm not really worried. <laughs> so there goes Mawile. And... the Kadabra. Should I go back to Thorn and try Crunch? I think I should. I'm gonna risk it. Because if I remember right, Kadabra doesn't have the best defenses. Um, or maybe, because I think... Oh, what is it? I think Dark is special, actually. So I'm not sure. Let's just try it. And it goes for Future Sight. Hopefully I'll be able to kill him before that. And... Oh, almost killed it in one hit. Oh, I'm not going to waste another Crunch. I'll just go for, like, a Headbutt after this. Maybe even a Cut will be enough to kill it. I'm just going to try that. And he go oh, okay, no. Psychic's going to kill me. Uh, damn it. That sucks. Okay, I think I should just stop using Thorn for a bit. Just let him be dead. <laughs> And sure, cat food, why not? 
I don't really know what to use because nothing's going to be super effective. So I'll just go for a shockwave, hopefully kill it right away. And there we go, cool. Lots of experience from that, pretty sweet. I couldn't do a thing, oh wah. <laughs> Alright, let's see, who do I want up front? Um, I'll put Bird Burr out there. Yeah. Alright, cool. So, I guess I'll try going up here first. Or oh, there's a strength rock right there. I'm not really sure what's going to be over there. Let's let's go this way. I'm feeling like this is the right way to go. Alright, rock smash. Wait, don't tell me this is somewhere I've been already. Um, oh, I think it is. Yeah, I've already been here. Okay, that's annoying. Um, maybe I should try going up this way then. Maybe, just maybe, this is somewhere I haven't been yet. So, let's see, how am I supposed to do this? Um, okay, I gotta push it up, and then, let's see. I can go push that to the side, that to the side, and then rock smash. That should work. And there's just an item here, so now I'm really not sure where to go after this. I guess I'll just have to keep backtracking and hope there's somewhere else I haven't been yet. And a full restore, that's pretty nice. I think there's some pretty good TMs somewhere in Victory Road, too. I came from down there just now, so yeah, I guess I have to go back over here. That's kind of annoying. Huh, well. Hell war off. Um, okay, I actually might have just screwed that up. Uh, let's see. I'm not really sure how I'm supposed to get out of here. Oh, I guess I can just do that, yeah. Okay, so I just do just need to keep pushing this one. And go back up this ladder, I guess. And now I'm out of the flash area. Isn't this back where Wally is? Okay, yeah. There has to be something I missed, because this is just ridiculous. Maybe I didn't go here yet. I don't think I did. Yeah, let's try this bridge. And there's another double battle. I guess I'm gonna have to do that at some point. Oh, here's an item. Uh, Max Elixir. That is the best one. Sweet deal. And... Wow. I just circled around. How do I get up there? Like, I seriously don't know how to get up there. Oh, found it! <laughs> just gotta circle around and... I can't... Okay, are you kidding me? <laughs> how do I get up that ladder? Whoa, that was weird. Okay, I need to find a ladder that I can go up that's right there. God, I'm just running through my repels because I'm just having to run around and I don't know where I'm going. That's the thing about Victory Road, it's so confusing. Okay, so I need to go down and then come back up right there. I don't know how that's gonna work. But I've already like explored everywhere. Okay, well this is my only option, so I don't really know what to do. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Having to go through the text every time. I know, Camel Toe, you're strong. Big buff Pokemon. So that's where that last guy I battled was. I'm pretty sure I did this. Yeah, I know I've I know I've been here. Go, Deku, do your stuff. And this just goes back down to this lady, and then over. Ah, what do I do? <laughs> this is this was nothing. This was a dead end. Uh, I don't want to have to look it up. Wait, have I been here? Yeah. Oh my gosh. <laughs> I'm so sorry, guys. I know I've probably walked right past where I'm supposed to go, but I just can't see it. Maybe there's something I missed here? I know I went up the waterfall. Okay, that's it. So we go up here, and there's this, and this trainer here that I don't want to battle. Did I go across here? Yeah, wait, I came from this direction last time. Now I'm really confused. Uh, wait, maybe I do need to go down here, because this is like the other side of that water. Other side of the rocks that are over here, maybe? Wait, huh? Where? There were rocks. Okay, you know what, I'm just going to go down here and see if this is new territory. I think it is, actually. No, okay, you gotta be kidding me. This is just the same 
Uh, <laughs> okay, well, I went up the waterfall last time, so maybe I didn't go up here. Yeah, there we go. That's the ladder I'm looking for. It has to be, because that's the other side of those rocks. And is this going to take me up? Okay, well, at least this is new, I know for sure. Uh, let's do this as a double battle, yeah. My Pokemon are cosmically awe-inspiring. Okay, no need to get your back up. Relax, let's take it easy. Let's take it easy? Yeah, it's, as in it's going to be really easy to destroy you. <sighs> cool trainer Mitchell and Hallie. I have a friend named Mitchell. Alright, Bird Brown and Sushi, let's see. This might be a decent matchup. Yay, intimidating them. <laughs> Alright, uh, let's just do the good old air cutter and surf. Um, yeah, that's not going to be very effective against Lunaton. Oh, and that was a critical. How about Sableye? Okay, yeah, not very good, but Surf should definitely take out Lunatone. Oh, are you kidding me? Wow, these Pokemon are good. Like, wow. <laughs> and I doubt both of them are going to heal, so... As for Faint Attack, that shouldn't do very much at all. Yeah, oh, especially because I'm resistant. Okay. Well, uh... I don't know what to do here. I doubt both of them are going to heal, but I have a feeling at least Lunatone will, so... I'm going to go for an... No, I'm going to go for a Steel Wing on Lunatone, and then Surf again. Oh, neither of them healed. Okay, well, that's fine, then. Oh, and... S oh, yeah, yeah, because Steel's good against Rock. Okay, well, there goes Lunatone, easily. I should have done that in the first place, but I assumed Surf would be enough to kill it. But should be enough for Sableye, given how much the first one did. And he sends out a Soul Rock. Okay. <laughs> Now I can just, now I know to just use Steel Wing and Surf and take these things out. Unless, okay, I was going to say, if that just killed it right away, that would be awesome. There goes Sableye, and let's see what their fourth Pokemon is going to be. Drum roll, please, it's an Absol. That thing's a really cool Pokemon. I like the way it looks, uh, I just think it's awesome. So, let's see. Uh, I'll just go for the Stealing on that, because I know I don't need it, because Solrock's going to get owned by even just a Waterfall, so let's do that. I don't think Dark is resistant to Steel, that would be kind of weird, so... And two of those is going to be enough to kill it, and I keep getting the defense raised, that's pretty awesome, Good, having good luck with that this battle. It doesn't even say that in the description of the move, that it can raise the user's defense, but it does, so... And Future Sight, yeah, dude, the battle has like one turn left at most, like what are you even doing? Alright, just going to go for another Steel Wing and Waterfall, and just get this thing done with. And good night, Absol. <laughs> Mitchell and Hallie were defeated. I never met anyone like you before. Whoa, wonderful. Okay, hang on. I want to check something. I'm just curious if Bird Bro and Sushi are my only two females. They are. Okay, that's kind of cool. Using those two in battles together. And let's see, I could go that way, or I could go down here. Not really sure. Ah, oh, the strength and rock smash thing here. That's fine. I'm probably going to have to go back and battle that lady and see what's past her. What if it's an item? I don't want to miss it. Um, oh well, I'll just continue on here for now. I'll probably have to come back anyways, because I never choose the right way to go the first time. You know me. Alright. Hidden item? Nope. My sense was tingling, but okay, here's that ladder that I was trying to find. Cool. So I know there's a double battle coming up over here. Uh, well, there's this guy first. Yeah, no choice to battle him. I've made it this far a couple of times, but the last stretch is so long. Ugh, thanks, dude. Thanks for telling me I probably have, like, three more videos in this godforsaken place. And he sends it a Cacturn, which is fine, because it's weak to flying, so I'll just go for Aerial Ace. And... oh, come on, that almost killed it in one hit. That's so annoying. And because he used Ingrain, I doubt he's going to heal it, too. I don't know, though. Let's let's see. Okay, just in case he does heal, I'm going to use Fly, because it's more powerful. And yeah, he did. Okay. So then on the next turn, I'll be able to probably easily take it out with one hit. I mean, if Aerial Ace did that much, Fly is a little bit more powerful. And so... There we go. And... There goes Cacturn. Awesome. That thing's down and out. And a Pelipper. I'm gonna go into uh, Cat Food for that. 
I probably don't even need to use a Thunderbolt. Probably Shockwave will be enough to kill this thing because it's double weak to it. And, I mean, Pelipper isn't the best Pokemon in the world anyways, so... Let's just go for that. I'm gonna laugh if it does kill- Aw, oh, really, dude? Why even bother? Ugh. I know it protected itself, just use- Thank you for failing! Wow, okay, and if this doesn't kill it in one hit, I'm gonna- I mean, I'm just an idiot. <laughs> Come on. Come on. Yes, okay. This guy was no challenge at all, really. Edgar. <laughs> Sorry, dude, that's not the coolest name in the world. <laughs> So there's the double battle, and there's nothing over here. I'm not really sure why this little stretch is even there. Or I could I could skip them. I'm going to do that. I've had enough trainer battles. <laughs> if there's any that are skippable, I might as well do it. Is that it? That was it? Oh my gosh, I'm already done with Victory Road. Wow. So here we are back out in nice Evergrande City. And now we must go and present our badges and go into the freaking Pokemon League. Holy crap, I did not expect to get here this fast. Okay, well, let's go heal up. I am not going to battle the Elite Four just yet because I am going to do some off-screen training uh, back down in Victory Road. I like to get everyone up to level 50. I know some of the Elite Four have Pokemon that are even a higher level than that, but that's just how I roll. <laughs> Alright, let's see what I can buy here. Um, don't really think I'll need any more Ultra Balls. I think I'm good on that. Um... Hyper Potions, how many do I have? I have 10. I think I'm a... Uh, should I buy... I'm gonna get to 15. I'm also gonna go back to, like, Lily Cove and get maybe even some more Lemonades, and then probably get some more Lava Cookies. I don't know. Um, I have a few Max Potions. I only, have, I only have one. I don't really think I need those. I mean, none of my Pokemon are gonna have more than 200 HP. But I might as well get two more, just have three of them. Oh, whoops, except I hit B. No, you know what? Let's just go all out. I mean, I have so much money. There's really no reason not to spend it. That's what this is for. Um, you know what? Freaking... What is that? What on earth is that music coming from? Yeah. Oh, my freaking... Okay, sorry about that. Um, my, uh... Yeah, sorry about that. My Netflix decided to start playing out of nowhere, even though I'd had it paused, so that was kind of funny. Um, let's see. For restores, I'll get a few more. Those are surprisingly not very expensive, given how good they are. So I'll get three of those. There we go, full heals. Um, I have four, I'll get one more. I also have berries and specific status healing items. Revive, I have seven, I'll get three more. I don't gonna need to revive my Pokemon 10 times, but I might as well, I mean, while I'm here, you know. All right, so there we go, got plenty of those items. And let's go back down, actually, yeah. Um, since I still have a couple minutes left in the video, I'll go to that one other stretch that I passed in Victory Road and go to um, where that lady was. And Repel wore off. Well, yeah, I'll put one back up. When I do my off-screen training, like I said, I am going to have to be doing it on uh, wild Pokemon, which don't give quite as much experience, so it's going to take a while. Um, yeah, I don't really feel like battling them. I'll probably do them off-screen, them off too. And let's see. Where was that splitting path? It was down below... Yeah, so I went up this ladder. And I got to use Flash again. Okay. I'll switch Thorn back out to the front. There we go. Yay, cat food! Saving the day once again, and let's see if I can get out of here. Oh yeah, I only have to break one rock and then move the other one out of the way. Alright, and this will probably be the last cool trainer I battle on screen in this, in this Let's Play, so let's do this. This isn't the goal, it's only a place on the way to the Pokemon League. Yeah, I know, I've already been there. I was about to go fight the Elite Four. I decided to come back just for you, Michelle. And a Torkoal, okay. Oh, well, I don't have to worry about conserving PP, so I'll just go for Dragonclaw. Probably gonna be a two-hit KO. Yeah, nice. Amnesia. Um, I don't know what that does. Makes his special defense right raise. Okay. I think Dragon is physical, though. I'm really not sure. I guess we'll find out and see if this doesn't kill it when I finally get to attack if it stops using Protect. Thank you for failing on the second try, just like that stupid Pelipper. Okay, so Dragon is special in this game. I did not know that. Now I do. And she goes for... Okay, well, given how little Dragon Claw is going to do because of uh, that uh, Amnesia... 
Let's go for Crunch, because I think... No, actually, I think Dark is special in this game, too. Okay, let's just go to... Well, so is Water Moves, but that's fine. A Surf better be enough to kill this stupid thing. Even if it takes two, that's fine. Just, I mean... Yeah, I don't care about Intimidate not working. I'm not too worried about you attacking me. Oh my gosh. What do you gain? What do you gain? <laughs> Thank you for failing. I'm trying to just spam protect like an ass. And... Oh, come on, dude. Okay, thank you for not healing again, but still using protect. Blech, there we go. Finally, Torkoal's dead, and she still had two more Pokemon. Kind of irritating, but that's fine. And a Metacam, I will go to Bird Bro, and obviously use... Um, I'll go for Aerial Ace. I know Fly's more powerful, but I don't want to have to wait two turns to attack. No, I hit down and then I hit A and then down and then A. And the down part didn't register apparently. Not sure why. Mind reader, whoa. I don't even took aim. I didn't even know that move existed. I'm not sure what that did, but it doesn't matter because Metacam is now dead. And Ludicolo. Let's see here. What's gonna be effective against that? I honestly don't even know. Um well I know flying won't be, so. Actually, no, I think flying will be, because it's water grass, and I don't think water's resistant to flying, so... Yeah, let's do that. And that thing is so weird looking, it's just like, it's too happy. <laughs> kind of like, um... Oh, what was that other Pokemon I was saying just looked way too happy? Oh, well, there's Wooper. It has no arms, and it's still just like the happiest looking Pokemon in the world. Okay. So there goes her, and now we can go down and see if she was hiding an item or something. And Bird Bro leveled up. That's good, that's what I'm going for anyways. And that's the way! Uh-huh, uh-huh, I like it! Uh-huh, uh-huh, that's the way! Uh-huh, okay. I'm so sorry you had to hear that. Let's see what we have here. Hopefully not too much further. Is this the same... Wait, okay, now I'm really confused. You know what, I don't even care. I'm done. I'm done with Victory Road. I'm getting out of here. So... That is going to be all for this episode, so what I'm going to do is go down the wrong ladder, apparently. And like I said, I'm going to do a lot of off-screen training, just grind on wild Pokemon in here till everyone's up to level 50, and I will catch all the wild Pokemon I find that I don't have yet, but I don't think I'm going to bother showing any of that, just because it would be like, you know, I want the next episode to, me, to be me going on to the Elite Four, and I don't want to waste the first half of the episode with recordings of me catching new Pokemon. So what I'll probably do is just show you all the ones that I caught in the PC at the beginning of the next episode, just so you can see what I did off screen. But other than that, it's just going to be fighting, um, fighting wild Pokemon and trainers. But I'm going to get out of here first and go heal again before I start doing that, which is why I'm still on screen now, and I know this episode's a bit long, but that's okay. So yeah, that'll do it for now. So I hope you guys enjoyed, and next time I will be fighting the Elite Four. So please give the video a like, comment, and subscribe, and I will see you all later. Goodbye.